If you've been waiting to get your hands on the new OnePlus 2 and you live in America, it looks like you're gonna have to wait a little bit longer. OnePlus just announced that they're delaying the American release of their new flagship killer phone due to production schedules. Well, we've never been patient when it comes to getting our hands on new devices. And lucky for us, OnePlus sent us a unit to tear down. So let's get to it. Hi, I'm Gwendolyn with iFixit, and today we're tearing down the OnePlus 2. The OnePlus 2 is almost the same size as its previous version, measuring in at 151.8 millimeters long, 74.9 millimeters wide, 9.85 millimeters thick, and weighing in at 175 grams. The OnePlus 2 comes with a 5.5 inch LCD in-cell 1080p full HD display with a pixel density of 401 pixels per inch. Normally at this point, we get to cracking open the OnePlus 2, but since our friends from Creative Electron were visiting with their TrueView Prime X-ray machine, we thought it would be fun to get a preview of what's to come for us in our teardown, and to show you some awesome photos just like this. Once we had our fun with the X-ray machine, it was time to get to tearing down the OnePlus 2. Opening the back plate was easy enough, just an opening tool and fingers peeled it off in a snap. But it looks like to get to the battery, we've got some more work to do. Looks like the easy to remove back plate is all for show because now we're met with screws hidden under rubber covers. All I can say is, it's better than glue. And finally, we get our first glimpse inside and see the bright red battery that has a message just for us. Challenge accepted. The battery is held in place by some mild adhesive, but some gentle spudgering is all it took to take it out. This is a 3.8 volt, 12.16 watt hour, 3,300 milliamp hour battery, a marginal upgrade from the OnePlus One. Next out were the cameras, both of which came out with just some simple prying. The rear facing camera is 13 megapixels and boy are those pixels big, 1.3 micrometers to be exact. Currently, that's the biggest in a 13 megapixel smartphone camera. It also has an F2 aperture, is capable of recording 4K resolution video and 120 frames per second slow motion at 720p. We turned our attention to the motherboard next, which was only held in place by one screw. On the motherboard, we see the four gigabytes of LPDDR4 RAM made by Samsung. And using our X-ray vision, we see that the 64-bit Qualcomm Snapdragon 810 processor with 1.8 gigahertz octa-core CPU and Adreno 430 GPU is hiding underneath. On the other side of the board, you'll find the 64 gigabytes of Samsung eMMC NAND flash memory. The OnePlus 2 is the first smartphone we've torn down to adopt the USB-C port. This all-in-one port was next on our list to be removed and it came out attached to just one long cable. Should make replacing this part affordable. Lastly, we set to work on separating the display from the mid-frame. Not surprisingly, we had to bust out the eye opener as it was glued in place. With the adhesive dealt with, we were able to free the display from the mid-frame and got a look at the backside of the 5.5 inch display. We've come to the end of our teardown, which means it's time to talk repairability. At iFixit, it's our mission to teach people how to repair everything, so we give every gadget we tear down a repairability score between one and 10. 10 being the easiest to repair and one being the most difficult. The OnePlus 2 scored a seven out of 10, and here's why. On the upside, a single non-proprietary screw head decreases the cost of tools for repairs, Many components are modular and can be replaced independently, and the USB-C port is on a relatively simple flex cable, not an assembly. It should be an inexpensive replacement. But on the downside, the LCD and digitizer glass are fused together and must be replaced as a single part. Heat is required to remove it from the midframe. Special thanks to OnePlus for sending us this teardown unit and Creative Electron for letting us use their x-ray machine. For the complete teardown, including tons of beautiful high quality images and more x-rays, head on over to ifixit.com. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on all our latest teardowns and repair videos. You can follow us on Twitter at ifixit and give us a like on Facebook at facebook.com slash ifixit.